and uh, Yoshikaze will fight Ikioi, who's coming off the glory of the win over the Chinojo team. <laughs> Three bouts to go here on day seven, and up next, another Ozeki. Koko Shogiku. It's Takayasu. Am I correct? And I, I guess I shouldn't ask you this because I should know the answer. Uh, we have not had a day this tournament where all Ozeki and Yokozuna have won. I'm um, I'm not good at numbers, but I get that feeling that you're right. Because it wasn't that situation wasn't when I was on two days ago. Mm -hmm. And yesterday, Mr. Shogaku lost. Mm -hmm. Did he lose? Mm -hmm. Yes, he's yep. lost two in a row. Yep. So still. We haven't had a day when, well now no, we only have two Yokozuna. Yeah, but, but still. But that particular day, yeah. the Yokozuna lost. Yeah. And the Ozeki won, but... Uh, so, Kota Shogiku coming off two losses in a row, taking on Takayasu, who's two and four. The history between the two does favour heavily Kota Shogi. Six to one. The last two days, Kota Shogiku's had way too much forward lean in his uh, sumo. The feet are being left behind and the upper body is being tumbling Takayasu who managed to address the redressing of Chiritaru yesterday mm -hmm. oh I've never seen him pounce on the Mawashi so quick after the touch today to <laughs> say that there was something wrong with the Mawashi. Huh. Mm, 1.5 seconds into the bat. Oh, really? Yeah. Kakadu. Now, he and that man are the only undefeated. Still yet to fight, of course, with Ichinojo losing earlier. Sitting in beside Kumiga, the former Koto Inazuma. At the moment, three men with 6 1 records Kisuno Sato, Ichinojo, and Okunoon. Kota Shogiku 3 and 3. He was in the Yusho race right up to the end of the previous, but already three losses. Takayasu fighting at Nagashi at 2, and can find 11 and 4 in uh, Nagoya. It's feeling a little tough at the moment, at 2 4 mark. He's had, of course, the tough slate. Kumasubi and uh, the Joijin get a tough first week. <laughs> so if you not so, they get it in the second week. And anybody who's been doing really well in the lower reaches is suddenly brought up in the second week. Yeah, yeah Ichinojo is going to be in that position, even with just the one loss. <laughs> Don't know if this has become overdone now. It's mm -hmm. initially he did for his back problem, but um, mm -hmm. so it's <laughs> expected. Takayasu, can he cause the upset here? Quite possible. Mm -hmm. He'd done it once before against Koto Shogiku. See the footwork, has it improved today for Koto Shogiku? He's looked a bit sloppy the last couple of days. Deep and high, 
He must get thrown down by the Ozeki. Left hand in, and down goes the Ozeki. Mm -hmm. Three in a row he's going down to drop him to three and four. And Takayasu beats him for just the second time. Skuinage, both the songs are on. Didn't expect his brilliant performance in the previous <laughs> tournament. Expected him to do well in this yeah, tournament. Yeah. Um, four losses in the first seven days. But as you said, Takayasu can't be underestimated. Not happy. <laughs> A shoulder blast, a little unusual approach, but see, I thought, oh, well, you're way too high, foot off the mm -hmm. ground, that's not going to help. Yep. But watch the forward lean here, I mean, it's helped by the throw, but oh, yeah. the oh. feet are too far back in mm -hmm. just about all his positioning at the moment for Porto Shogiku. There it's okay, but here, look how far back he is, he's overextending, and just set up nicely, he's screwed up here. Takayasu up to three and four. He has Endo tomorrow. Kaku Shogiku has Takara Fuji. Remember the tougher opponents for Kaku Shogiku come in the second week. <laughs> Supposedly tougher opponents. Mm -hmm. What's the vibe like in uh, the uh, Yogoku area right now with all the, the lead up to the tournament? Oh, uh, oh, thrilled, thrilled, yeah. Especially that, uh, that since the tickets are going so well. I mean, I, on Monday I uh, 